Friday night, pizza night. Yep, these are a lot of families, right? And well, don't order out, make it yourself. Chef Jamie's in our Super Home Surplus Kitchen. Hello, we love, love Chef Jamie. He's saying, listen, make it from scratch. It's not that hard. I know. Says the chef. I know. Listen, we had this discussion. I said, look, I'm intimidated because the whole dough thing. He said, nope, I've got the recipe, and you can do it in like an hour. It's not. I thought you had to do it the day before, let it rise. No, it's easy. Yeah, we'll let the dough rise. Stay tuned. All right, yeah. I hope I get down for us. Also, we're going to figure out this whole change in the horoscope, the whole zodiac sign. Remember NASA said, hey, listen, your horoscope has changed. They made me from a Leo to a Cancer. They made I you from Scorpio to Li Libra, I think. They really just threw off just, everything. It's wrong. It's listen, all wrong. We got down to the bottom of it. We've got the pro here. Astro Girl. Susie Kerr Wright. Hello! Hi, we are so happy she's here. She's going to break it all down for us. This is her whole world, and we are so excited to have her on, and she's going to be great. And the super moon, she's going to tell us all about how that's going to affect your entire weekend thing. All of it. Yes. All of it. Speaking of the weekend, people are gearing up. Bridgestone is like the place to be all weekend right. So big. <laughs> okay. okay, big show. All right, we've got Ayla Brown in our band. Wow, the sound check was amazing. They are having fun. Look, listen, do we deliver here today in Nashville? <laughs> Enjoy the happy hour, folks. Oh, it's pizza time. Chef Jamie's in the house. We're going to help him roll out the dough and make some pizza from scratch. And right after the break, we are getting down to it with Astro Girl. Yes! I hope you're Facebook Live now. She's got the new Zodiac signs, and she's going to talk. I mean, she's going to talk about those new Zodiac signs when we come back. Super Welcome back, everybody. Remember when NASA announced that our astrological signs had changed and that those of us that were Virgos are Libras and those of us that were Scorpios are now Libras and everybody's a Libra, That's I guess? That's the whole thing. It, like, rocked our worlds a little bit. I'm we, were, we were pretty the about the whole thing. We were right. just like, oh. Anyway, we got Astro Girl here, Susie Kerr, right, to talk all about this because we were like, how could they change it? They said the Earth has changed. What? So the Earth has moved around a little bit, so the Zodiac sign means it changed. Astro Girl, what's the deal? Okay. Um, well, don't panic because your signs have not changed. Thank it's, you. It is all false. Thank it you. It is all uh, a conglomeration of about three different pieces of information that are completely not related to astrology, <laughs> basically. Okay, whatever so, sign you were born under, you're still you're that still sign. You're still that sign. Don't panic. And, you know, it's so funny because, you know, so many people go, around, oh, I don't believe in astrology. I hear that all the time. I'm an astrologer. I do this for a living, you know? And it cracked me up so bad how many calls and emails and things I got when this surfaced. And this surfaced about five years ago. Oh, damn. And five years before that and now it's resurfacing it just keeps coming back because those scientists keep meddling with well, our astrology the funny thing is NASA didn't do it NASA didn't assign the science the Babylonians created basically they're, they're you know credited with creating astrology the astrological okay. format that we know now mm -hmm. and they took into account of Fucus by the way that's how you pronounce the name of that 13th sign it's a constellation it's not a sign so there's a band of 12 signs the zodiac signs that we all know and they right. kind of move around the earth it's like in, in kind of of a, a, an evenly divided line, Got it. twelve signs equally divided, and uh, as we you know move around the sun and all the everything moves and shifts, the sun it is in those constellations at different times, and that's how we determine your sun is in Virgo, your sun is in Scorpio. Oh, so that's why it's like, hey, you're going to be kind of good this month, and right, the right, next right, month, right. It's, and that's all very generic, you know, because you right. never really, really know what's going on in somebody's world until you really look at their whole chart. Right. But generally speaking, that's how the sun signs work. And so, uh, and so what they're saying is that we didn't, you know, astrologers, the ancients, didn't take into consideration something called the precession of the equinox, which means everything shifts and moves a little bit. But they did. They oh, did. Oh, they did. Yeah. They All right. did. All right. And so we've always known a few because there. Now his, his big toe is kind of dipping in between Sagittarius and Scorpio. Oh, my goodness. And it's really nothing. Really deep. It means nothing. It means nothing. This is aha moments. This is turning points for people. The people most impacted are going to be like Aries, Cancer, Libra, and Capricorn, the cardinal signs. But really, I mean, everybody's going to feel it on some level. This is huge. Um, it, you know, we get full moon, new moon every month. We get the sun opposing Uranus every year. But this, because it's all coming together the way it is now, this is big. So we're going to have a lot of great, um, it, it's really going to rock our world. And, and, you know, good or bad, it just depends on how you look at it and how you're experiencing it in your world. You but know? you're saying it could be aha. Oh, absolutely. Uranus is called the 
great awakener for a reason. So waking up mm -hmm. to new ideas inspired me. Yes. 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 astrogirl12.com for more info on Susie. Thank you so much for being here. Thank, Thank you, Susie. I'm feeling bad for anyone working.